Hello and welcome to this YouTube tutorial on how to create 3D YouTube videos in After Effects. Firstly, all you need to do is basically um, have a 3D environment. I mean, I made mine from using a solid and then using particular, and then basically I have little balls flying at me, or basically at the camera, and then blah 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 blah. blah. Anyways, and then all you need to do with the camera that you have created, <coughs> right click on it and then go into transform and then go into the last option. And then it, it normally is uh, um, oriented towards a point of interest, however, set it to off is copy that layer and then because I've already done it here and you, and for. For the second camera that you just copied, basically the position of the x axis should be at six. I mean, basically whatever the this value is, add six to it. Because I found out from research that the distance between our eyes is was a six. I mean, six point three five centimeters or millimeters. I'm not sure, but yeah, it was six six point six point three five. I know that for definite. I thought I'd just like put six. I mean personal um, preferences, but if, if you want to go for six point three five, go ahead. If you have any other numbers, go ahead. But good luck with that. Yeah. So basically, set it at six point six four six, and then this one will be at six forty. Yeah. And now all you need to do is go into the project, and then the because I've already renamed it. It should be composition one. And because I already renamed it as, um, I renamed it as left, as in for the left eye or left camera, left whatever. And then all you need to do is copy it. And then, because I've already copied it into, or well, this is meant to say right. Sorry for my writing errors. Yeah, and then, as I said, and then all you have to do is double click on it to open it. And then for this one, you need to in this right, you need to hide the left cam by pressing this I icon over here at the end of the thing. I don't know how you use what I've laid out your After Effects tables, whatever you call it. But basically, you need to hide the left camera and then in the left composition, hide the right camera. Yeah, hide it. And then all you need to do is create a new composition, which I have here. And then this new composition includes the left and the right um, eye cameras that I have created here and that all I have to do is slot it into here and then from here you need to actually have a yeah, let me delete it basically have create a new solid um, I, I pressed control Y for those who don't know how to do that and it doesn't matter what color it is I to choose blue I don't know why it just came up and then go into effects perspective 3d glasses and then for it has the simple interface and um, probably most of you i don't know if you lot have know about this plugin i think it's a built in into effect i think it, it comes with after effects and then from the left view click on the left composition which is down here and then the right view click on the right which is meant to be here Originally, I mean, make sure these are switched off because you get this thing in the middle, which you don't want. And then, basically, from here you can either basically export it into YouTube the way it is, because and then on YouTube you can add the tag where YouTube are that tag that YouTube have created for um, a 3D video, so it's the 3D. When you have two clips at the side, um, if you don't know about this, you can. Um, type it into YouTube 3D videos and whatnot and then you'll probably find the tag and then <coughs> or you can either change the 3D viewing from this 3D glasses into probably balanced colored where it puts everything together but yeah, it still has that and then you can or like there's these other things I don't know if, um, how they work but whoever invented them was a very clever person in it and there's, there's red and green for left and right 
and then there's I mean if you have the red and green glasses um, red and blue glasses and then there's balance red and green and then there's balance red and blue and then there's finally the one I prefer balance colored red and blue sounds longer and much better <coughs> and then if you have your 3D glasses you can pop them on pop them on and then yeah I mean if you can't see the 3D effect um, I think you need to fix your screen yeah um, so basically for me it is it is 3D for me yeah um, let me If you can't see that, I don't know. Basically, it is in 3D, and then from here, instead of wasting your time, and from here, and then from here, just basically choose this. You can even export it like this, or as in when it's side by side, and then all you need to do is you know, go into composition and then uh, it? add to rendering. You and then um, choose the settings that you want, and then basically these are the settings. And then here's where you want to save it, and then click render, and you render it out. Um, and that's and that's the tutorial. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment.